All right, guys, I have just gone grocery shopping. So now we are about to look at everything that I got. So it's a grocery haul. So let's do this. Ignore the messy, dirty background. Hopefully you can't see any of it. Okay, so let's just start. So first off, okay, because I'm trying to get like back in shape and everything, I went, whoa, got dino kale. And let me tell you something, my coworker, my old coworker, was like, yeah, if you like kale in the morning, if you like all that stuff, then you need dino kale. And it literally looks like something like a dinosaur would eat. And when I tell you it is so flavorful because it's better than the regular kale, right? Because all it needs is salt. And in the morning time, you know how regular kale will shrink down really, really small? This doesn't shrink at all. It will still remain the size. You just go ahead and take off the leaves um, like normal from the stem and you throw it on a skillet and I, I just put some like spray oil in it. It takes about, I don't know, maybe three minutes, three or four minutes to cook. And it has so much flavor, it can almost taste like collards. Like this is what I do in the morning time. And I'll do it with like an egg, right? Or you could, I haven't tried it in an omelet. I don't know if I'd go that far, but we'll see. Okay, so I got this fenugreek, I don't even know. So I got this, it's supposed to promote like hair growth. So it's a part of that whole like, what is it, Ayurvedic? Ay Ayurvedic, Ayur I, whatever the oils are that you're supposed to put in your hair. You know how like rosemary oil promotes hair growth and all that stuff. This is supposed to promote hair growth, but I saw a girl on TikTok in the comment section, you gotta read the comment section, and she was like, take it by, take it orally is better. It says take two capsules three times a day. That's a little bit too much. I don't know if I'm gonna start with that, but I got it, we're gonna try it. Um, also, anytime I go to Whole Foods, I stop and I get these. I thought I got two. I get these. Like, now you can make these shots at home. I already have a video. I'll link it below on how to make the shots at home. But every now and then, like, if I just want a quick pick me up or I'm already there at the store, I will get these shots. Um, one of these will really make you use the restroom, the one with pineapple. So this is turmeric relief shot, pineapple, lemon, ginger, turmeric, cayenne. And then this is a booster shot. This is orange, carrot, lemon, turmeric, Astra astragalus astragalus never heard of that grapefruit seed and oregano so i got these two let's see and then i always love cheese so i got like some little cheese bites like yay cheese these are really good um let's see i may i'm starting to like make my coffee more at home so i got some oatly the barista style um in the morning times when i make my kale in like oatmeal no no if i when i make my kale and eggs if i don't want an egg or something then i will do these cashew milk um yogurt smoothies blueberry they're so good they're probiotic i can just drink these all the time i will also mix in if i have time i will mix in my collagen now i've switched collagen that i'm taking i will tell you how i like it after i'm done with it so i'm not going to really share it right now um but this is my like trusty dusty and there's another one trusty dusty there's another one that I really like. I'm going to link that as well. Or not link it. Maybe I'll just post the name. And I just always have to go to Kroger to get it. And I don't have time for that. So this is my first time trying these. The brown rice cakes. Um, I don't know how I feel. But I feel that they're nice. Like non-GMO, whole grain, gluten free. I don't know how that's possible. But they are. And they're very thin. Like snack crackers. So I feel my mom got the big rice cakes. But I just saw those. So I'm going to try these. These are like a little sweet treat. These mustard pretzels that I saw at <laughs> Whole Foods literally had these in a little container. You can like dig your hand in it. And I always just like that person digging her hand and I'm gonna eat them. So these go good with the cheddar cheese, just like a regular snack. Um, I also just came back from Costa Rica. I'll post about that later. And we, you know, saw how they made like fresh cacao. I actually have fresh cacao seeds. Um, somewhere over here. I actually have them in here. It smells so freaking good. I have, I roasted them already. They're roasted. If you've never seen a fresh cacao seed. Well, actually you have to let them dry out, but like this is it roasted. It's really good. Cacao chocolate. Um, and so I got this. I don't know if it's going to be as good, but this is Madagascar vanilla bean from Madagascar. So we'll see how it is. This is a cute little, little snack at night. Um, so that's what I got from Whole Foods. Let's see what I got from TJ's. I love Trader Joe's. 
so cute. Okay, let's see. Flowers. You have to have flowers. They're so cute. I have this really cute canister. Let me show you. Died. I got them from the farmer's market. They've lived a long life, and so now they're going to be replaced with these. Oh, with the old and with the new, but these are so pretty. Uh, Sometimes when I don't feel like cooking, I go to Trader Joe's and I will make these, like whatever meal. I'll get whatever meals they have. So they have a black pepper beef with jasmine rays, beef strips, and like some veggies. And I really like this. I like it. So I was like, you know what? Let me make my own. Let me save money. So I got some peppers. And I couldn't remember what pepper it was, so then I bought another pepper. Because I saw green pepper in it. And then I brought the all natural shape beef steak. So I'm gonna make this this week. I think it's you just stir fry. So I'm gonna make like a nice stir fry. Put this in the fridge. Back into my health life. So I brought small bunches of celery because I have a tendency to let all my food spoil. So I'm trying this thing where I buy things in smaller bunches and then I will go ahead and be able to juice it. So I'm gonna do this juicing and then I always use the vitamin E oil from Trader Joe's. It's amazing. When I, I actually had like broke my nail. You can't tell, this is my nail. These are my real nails, by the way. Real nails, real length. Um, I broke, I had broke this nail really bad um, to the point where like part of the nail was off. It was bad. Um, and I was worried about it like changing color and it was like starting to like go yellow and it was, it was doing all that weird stuff that happens when you like break a nail or rip off a nail, whatever. Put this on it. Put this on your marks, put this on your body, put this on any type of scarring. This is it. And jojoba oil. I think this is another one that you could put in your hair. So I'm probably going to take this. Um, I am still might find, I still might get actual, what is it? Fen Greek. I still might get the actual one. Melt it down like rosemary. Because um, I ended up, of course, didn't I freaking... I thought I got the rosemary. Well, you can take that, this oil, rosemary, melt it down and make a hair oil. But I still got a hair oil. Okay, and cilantro, I was sad. So I got mint. Mint is good for digestion in your breath. So whenever I have digestive prop issues, you could just chew on this, apparently. Dill, because I want to make a tzatziki sauce or I have some and I needed to top it. And then basil, because you always need basil. And I also got those because I got this. See it? It's supposed to keep them living longer. So it looks like that tube and then you put it in there and then like just longevity, longevity. So, and you know that's what I'm saying? I could not, freaking forgot the rosemary and couldn't find cilantro. So yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead, these are pretty huge and put those in here. And that is like my grocery shopping for the week. So really quick video, thanks for tuning in. If you have any questions, let a girl know. I will, of course, answer them about eating healthy, all that kind of stuff. So thanks for tuning in. Okay, bye.